This is just going to be a really super quick review of this, but this is the TST TPMS system. Uh, I've been into this for a long time, I just never got around to doing it, but I've had this thing for a oh, year and a half, two years now I've been using it. <clears throat> and you can see there's the reading. Right now, I've been putting air in my tires. Just cycles through each tire, shows the uh, temperature on the back. Um, this one uses replaceable batteries, CR2032. It's those, you know, those, the one that, like the same one you're uh, most likely the remote for your car, the fob or whatever for your car uses. Same deal. That's what my Jeep uses and my wife's car. Um, you see where I've got it on the windshield. I don't have any for the Jeep. Probably at some point I may get them. I don't know. I don't want to lie to you and tell you I will. But it, it'll support, I don't know, crap. It'll support an 18-wheeler, so way more axles than I have. I don't, I've never had any reading problems. Um, it's only on the coach, but the thing to remember, this is a Bluebird, so it's all steel. So this, that's all metal. This is an all-steel coach, except for the front and rear caps. And the bay doors are fiberglass, sides, roof, back, or you know, sides, roof, everything, metal. This is the good old fiberglass, but so that's what I've been doing is putting air in my tires, and I just thought I'd show you off. It has those little things that screw onto the valve stem. And on the rear, I use crossfires. Um, you can look those up and I have the ones that are uh, have separate ports for each tire for the TPMS so I can actually put two sensors back here one on each side of the crossfire valve so it reads each tire I assume y'all can see that And honestly, looking at them and looking at some of the other ones that are sold, I, I got this feeling that it's the same company making a couple of different one of these because the, the Easy Tire and the other one, they all look the same. Even the readout looks the same. It's like it just comes in a different plastic box. So I'm not sure if they are. I've had this one and I've had zero problems with it. And actually, uh, <clears throat> one of the uh, little screw-on sensors, um, when they shipped it to me, I thought it was bad because it would not screw onto the valve. Um, and so I thought they had, it wouldn't thread it deep enough. I called them and they said, well, here they, I sent it, they said, we'll just send you another one. So they sent me one and it wouldn't fit and I ultimately found out that it was the, one of the things on the crossbar I had to buy a tap and, or a die and chase the threads a little bit, but good customer service. Um, and like I said, I've had it almost two years now. I had zero problems with it. I replaced the batteries. I went around replacing the batteries once about a month ago. Because one of them quit reading. But I don't take them off when I store it. The batteries are so dang cheap. Um, I just leave them plugged in all the time. So it made it almost two years uh, on a set of batteries. And like I said, those batteries are cheap. You know, I actually ordered them off... Uh, Amazon, I think you can get a big pack of them really cheap, like 20. I got the rest of them in my toolbox. So, just thought I'd give you a quick review. Highly recommend it. Recommend the Crossfires, and I recommend these, uh, this TST TPMS system. Thank you.